Well, it's pretty cold outside. I know a lot of people on uh, YouTube have been saying that it's pretty cold where they are, too. Um, one of the big differences is uh, around here there's no snow anymore. We had one big storm and I think one day that it just spit a little bit of snow and uh, then it rained and warmed up and now we have no snow but but she's cold out <laughs> pretty darn cold but anyway what I'm gonna do is uh, there's a guy down the road here um, he has a desktop uh, computer tower and I need a few parts for mine so I'm gonna go see if he uh, if he's willing to part with it I just noticed it sitting out on his uh, doorstep, so I'm going to go check it out, see if he's willing to part with it. Maybe he'll give it to me, maybe I'll have to buy it, I don't know yet. But anyway, I'm going to take a run out, and so anyway, I'm going to go. Well, I just got back, and uh, here's the computer. The guy, uh... The guy said the hard drive calfed out on him, so uh, he was just going to take it to the recycling depot, so just like I thought, he gave it to me. Um, I haven't tried it yet. kind of hoping it's going to work. But it's got uh, Windows Vista Home Premium, or at least the stickers there. There's no hard drive in it, and they, they took a few things out, but... I still have, you know, I have parts, so that's not a big deal as long as it fires up. So, let's look in here and see what we got. Oh, you got a cigarette package, which won't make it work any better. Uh, let's see, what are all these? Uh, HD audio, so they had an audio, USB. I have a USB thing kicking around here somewhere, um, and, don't know, okay, so, there's no hard drive, there's no, uh, DVD drive, which doesn't matter, because like I said, I have parts, still has the CPU fan, I'm assuming still the CPU, it's only got two RAM slots, so fingers crossed it has good RAM, like maybe 4 gig or something. Let's see, 1 gig, DDR2, and 1 gig DDR2, so that's good. It's not so bad anyway. Better than what I'm working on now. Mine's got DDR RAM in it, so. See if she'll fire up. Put my light on. There's a light on. And, uh... Yep. So I'm gonna just unplug that because it's kind of damp. Just wanted to know if it was gonna fire up. And it does. Let's uh, the power button just discharge some of the power. And we'll unhook this fan. I'm just curious. Kind of curious. 
curious to see how the hell you get that done. Little key. No pins on it, so it's probably a decent one. Hopefully, maybe a dual core. Well, I can't read that, so I'm just going to put it back in. Throw a hard drive in this and uh, see what happens. Well, the lighting's not very good in here, but I thought I'd make a quick video anyway. Uh, this is the computer I picked up the other day. And uh, I've been frigging around with it for a couple of days. I haven't had a computer to edit any videos on lately because my other one uh, isn't good enough to edit. So, I've been trying to get this one going. I use my neighbor's computer to put uh, to put my Windows 7 disk on that hard drive and I've been trying for a couple of days to uh, to get Windows 7 put on that uh, that computer and it doesn't seem to want to work so I'll just show you This thing, all it had in it when I got it was the motherboard, the CPU, and the RAM. There was no hard drive. There was uh, no CD drive. The guy that I got it from had cut all the all the wires in here for the power supply. So I put a power supply in it, and I put a hard drive in it. And I've been trying to install Windows, and and it'll get just so far. It'll get just so far, and it'll it'll just stop. So I don't know what's wrong with it. Just for the heck of it, I took a stick of RAM out, and then tried it again, and the Windows. Uh, installation would go a little bit farther and then it would freeze like it did before it it um, I don't know how to explain it well sometimes I guess it would uh, just go on the blue screen and then other times it would have a black screen it would say that windows couldn't load I don't know some something about hardware change and I can't figure it out I'm gonna try the neighbor tomorrow he's got a couple sticks of RAM over there that that I know are good so I'll try new RAM in it and hopefully that's uh, that's gonna fix it